I want to show you a very simple example of how the General Ledger batch approval workflow works in Dynamics GP. Let's start out with a simple transaction. I have a transaction entered already, and I want to add some documentation to this. So I'm going to click on the Note button. It'll bring up the Document Attachment Management screen. This allows me to attach a number of documents to this particular transaction. Here's the document right here I want to include on this particular General Ledger. I hit OK, attach it to the document. You can see that the document's attached here. I'm going to save this to this batch. Now let's take a look at the batch. I have workflow set up for this General Ledger batch entry. And you can see that right here I've got a ribbon that shows me the status of this particular batch. Now I've got one transaction in that. It has not been submitted yet, so I'm going to submit that. I'm going to put a little note in here and submit it to workflow. Now I'm logged in as a batch approver. There's a number of ways to approve a batch, but let's just take a simple look at one. Here's a batch here, and you can see the workflow status here. It still needs to be approved. It's pending approval right here. Because I'm the approver, I can go in and I can approve it right here. I can add a little note if I want to, and then approve it. And if I go back and look at that batch, I can see that the batch approval has been completed. I can view the history of that batch approval. And here you can see the actions that were taken on that particular batch. So it's OK now. And I'm just going to go ahead and post it. And that's the entire process.